when I was a teenager and my dad took me down to Crosley Field to catch a glimpse of my baseball hero, Charlie Hustle, Pete Rose, in action. Little did I know I was going down to see a future public enemy number one in watching Pete play. We all know the controversy about Pete being accused of betting on baseball and denying it back in the late 1980s and being banned for life from the sport that he loved and the sport that he built. Well, over the years, we've all come to accept, at least in our own minds, that well, Pete probably did bet on baseball. And now, the real controversy. ESPN comes out, somebody, somebody gave them a betting sheet from when Pete was a player, saying, yes, he bet on baseball, not just when he was a manager, but when he was a player even before that. Is that a shock to anybody if it's true? This man has given up a quarter of a century when he should be in the Hall of Fame, when he should be on the baseball diamonds. He's 75 years old. There are players who snort up half of Columbia and get a second, third, and fourth chance. They beat their wives. They kill their roommates. But they get back on the playing field. It's time to get... I don't, I don't know who he made mad. But it's time to get off Pete Rose's back and while he's alive, put him in the Hall of Fame. This is the year to do it. The All-Star Game. Bring Pete back. You're acting like a bunch of small, spoiled school kids. Bring Pete back and do it today.